take your word for it. I am sorry either way. If you really want to make it up to me, I've heard you guys have some killer rocket launchers to spare. Absolutely not. Both agree this isn't something we can ignore. Between what we learned at AMS and the journal we recovered from Harper's Ferry, this is big. If this is the source of the super mutant threat, I'm prepared to support any action to end it. Initiate. Good timing. I can't believe he just walked in here. He must have been at work even then. I never said it was my fault, Initiate. To think. The arrogance... Enough of that. The question facing us now is how to find him and the people who've been taken. Lucky for us, Scribe Valdez has made a discovery of her own while we were away. That's right. Remember the Pip-Boy you found in the Uncanny Caverns? It took a while to crack the encryption, but... I've unlocked it. It came from Vault 96. It took a bit of research to locate it, but it's well south of here. I'll mark it on your map. Well, we're not sure it is. What we do know is that we have a definitive lead to follow. The super mutant threat takes priority. If we find the missing civilians in the process, so much the better. So we cannot ignore this lead. Unsurprisingly, Night Shin and I don't see eye to eye on this. Fortunately, in this case, we don't have to. I think they're connected. A vault would be a great place to hide abductees. The Pip-Boy might even have come from someone that Then we're escaped. agreed. The vault will be your next target. Scribe Valdez will accompany you. A vault is a potential trove of exactly the kind of technology the Brotherhood is meant to catalog. I've marked Vault 96 on your map. We don't know what we're walking into, or even how we'll get in, to be honest. We'll need to be cautious. Step one is finding a way in. You'll take point. Based on other vaults we found crossing the country, the vault should have an emergency transponder. Once you've secured the entrance, the controls for the transponder are usually there near the main door. Activate it to give the all clear and I'll follow you in. I'm glad to hear it. It's a good plan, and I think we're all in agreement on this one. Find any evidence you can about the missing people, and any connection to the super mutants. If Blackburn is there, I want him taken alive. If he really is behind the abductions, he needs to answer for his crimes. You have your orders, Initiate. Good luck. Dismissed. I'm glad you're with us, Initiate, and sorry you have to see us at our worst.
A little late to the party, aren't you? If you're looking to loot the place, some blood eagles are ahead of you in line. I'd stop you, but... Uh, I think I quit. Name's Woods. Corporal Woods. Hellcat Company. Mercenaries. We got hired by this creep of a doctor to guard the place. Among other things. Promised us salvage rights here when he was done. I don't think we're gonna collect on that. Our squad was guarding the entrance here when we were overrun by blood eagles. Killed everyone. <laughs> uh, me too. I just haven't kicked it yet. Yeah. Raider types, but more bloodthirsty, you know? You can usually deal with the crater sort. Blood eagles, though. <laughs> they enjoy the killing. Hell of a bedside manner you've got. You know I'm dying, right? <sighs> Go ahead. Not like I'm doing anything else. Clock's ticking, though. Yeah, Blackburn. Real unnerving guy, even before we found out what he was doing. Kidnapping was just the start of it. We should have cut ties then, contract or no. Even Merc should have lines they don't cross. I'd say I didn't have a choice, but... We're mercenaries. And we do it for the money, not some noble ideal. Nobody to blame but ourselves. <laughs> That's kind, but... It's a little late for that. I've seen enough gut shots in my time to know a stim pack and fan. Wow, it's freezing in here. Look at all this ice. The environmental controls must be damaged. What happened here? Those are Hellcat Company uniforms, right? It looks like a massacre. Blood Eagles? What are they doing here? Looks like Paladin Romani was right. There's a link between the abductions, Blackburn, and the super mutants. We still need to figure out what. Give me a moment to look at these terminals. Ooh, that's not good. The vault's on internal lockdown. I guess someone's responding to the Blood Eagle attack. If there are automated defenses still working, they'll all be active. We may be facing more than just Blood Eagles. Be careful. Let's get moving. I'll follow your lead. Locked. Must be the security lockdown. Let me try something. Got it. 
I was able to use the Pip-Boys protocols to get the doors open, but it fried the circuits. If we run into any more locked doors, we're gonna need another way through. I can not be responsible for what may happen if you remain. We need to search everywhere, but our options are limited right now. I think that door labeled mainframe is stuck open, though. Let's start there. That's over with.
just shadows. Research log, Dr. Edgar Blackburn, number 22. In retrospect, my enthusiasm for the cryogenically preserved specimens in the vault was excessive, if not actually misplaced. I am down to the last four viable test subjects. Further research is at an impasse, unless I move to human subjects. Obtaining volunteers will be impossible. The necessary experimentation to even approach a functional result will be unavoidably fatal to some. I will have to take extreme measures to obtain subjects. Thousands, perhaps millions of lives will be saved. Utility trumps sentimentality and law. Persistent refusal to depart is a distraction I do not need. Please, I am asking you again. Leave this place and do not return. There is nothing for you here but sorrow. Whatever you think you will accomplish here, I promise you that you will not. Please step into the open and identify yourself. For a
research log, Dr. Why Edgar Blackburn, number 38. The capture of human test subjects is itself less difficult than I imagine. The people of Appalachia are in bad need of medicine, and lone travelers are easy to approach when one has a doctor. I'd help. Is that you, Basher? Wow, you're an even worse liar than I am. Wait, that voice. I know who you are. Oh, you're the one I talked to back at Fort Atlas. You know her? What? I can fix that, but you gotta agree to help first. I can make it worth your while. I've been trying to get us out of here since we've been locked in. I just found this vault security key card. It should open all the doors in this place. You help us, and it's yours. Valdez? You got someone else out there? <laughs> should I be jealous? I don't think we've got much choice. We're going to need that key card to bypass the rest of the security doors. Now we're talking. Now give me a sec to get the door open. Good thing Shin's not here. I don't think he'd agree to this. No shooting, boys. They're on our side. Crap, here they come again. Lucky Tally vouchers for you. Damn. Good thing you showed up when you did. Looks like I was right about you. Shame we keep meeting under these circumstances. We could get into some real trouble. Can't believe the Brotherhood bailed us out. Well, the deal's a deal. Key card's yours. Yeah. Banged up, but... With the coast clear, we should be able to get out of here. I don't say this a lot, but thanks. 
I can't believe we just got thanked by a blood eagle. Twice the time. All yours. You got this far, so I'm guessing the way you came is clear. Thanks again. Maybe we won't even shoot you if we see you again. No promises. You've got interesting friends, Initiate. Research log, Dr. Edgar Blackburn. I begin to doubt my own sanity at times. My efforts, while not without progress, continue to fail to bear real fruit. The FEV seems almost deliberately malignant, as if it had a consciousness, and rejects my every attempt to bend it toward a benevolent end. I've come to recognize the signs of imminent metastasis and conversion to the so-called super-mutant state. I am ill-equipped to deal with the product of such failure and have taken to disposing of these unfortunates outside the vault itself. I regret that my current method of disposal may, in the short term, increase the super mutant population in Appalachia, but it cannot be avoided. End long. What a smell. At best, they made weapons. Such a pointless waste. I have turned what they left behind to better ends. I regret the ugliness you find here. The things I had to do. Research log, Dr. Edgar Blackburn. Who's that person bringing me the number 112? Oh, forget that. My work's demand for human subjects has increased dramatically as I make ground toward my ultimate goal. To this end, I have contracted with a group of mercenaries calling themselves the Hellcat Company. Trustworthy, if such a term applies here. They display a useful moral flexibility. They do not question the nature of my work or my need for human subjects. And I do not eliminate them. Already they have begun acquiring new subjects at a far greater pace than I could. And a contingent remain to guard the vault itself. I must be a mercenary. You're not with those others, are you? Can you get us out of here? Cassie, Cassie Alloway. L listen, I ain't trying to be rude. I'll tell you my whole dang life story if you want. Just get me out of here first. I feel sick. Everything hurts. Uh, not exactly. I, feel sick. I think the locks are controlled remotely. The doctor guy always does something back behind the stairs there, before he comes back to grab one of us for his tests. Okay, I was gonna go for a walk, but I guess I'll stay here for now. Sorry. Seriously, though. Thank you. Is he coming back? Is he coming back?
Molly Cooper Biology Log uh, 280. What is this? die in here. Oh, thank God. You've got my thanks, stranger. Introductions are in order, I guess. My name's Cassie. Did I say that already? Yeah, that's me. You know Uncle R? God, he's got me so worried. He might even express an emotion besides world-weary. Oh, <sighs> I hope he's all right. Now that sounds like a fun bunch. Uncle Art mentioned them in, uh, broad terms. Can't say I'm not glad to meet you, though. I'm not injured. Got lucky. The doc didn't do any surgery on me. That nut job was dosing Everything me with hurt. diseases, though. I feel Said he was sick. testing incubation and immune response times. <sighs> Weird thing is, he kept apologizing. Is he bad case of sludge back? line now. <clears throat> but I'm... <clears throat> I'm holding up. <clears throat> Some of the others are in worse shape. For real? You must be my guardian angel. Well, well, I did get kidnapped and locked up by a mad scientist, so... Maybe not. <laughs> but still, thank you. You get to miss and breathe normally. Somebody get us out of here. Maybe I could, but... There's no way the rest will. I don't even know where we are, but <coughs> I'm guessing we're not close to civilization. These folks won't make it a mile in their condition. Everything it's better if they stay here. When we've sick. cleared the vault, I'll radio Fort Atlas. They can send the medics Please. with the recovery team and get them to safety. I'll leave Fort some food Atlas and water is, for you to share exactly until help arrives. Thanks, kindly. You're a peach. We ain't going anywhere. Hey, if you run into that crazy doctor, give him a kick for me, all right? Please, don't let him take me again. Thanks again for the rescue. Card doesn't work? Blackburn must have overridden the door codes. Probably guess the looters might find a key card eventually if they had the run of the place. If he's changed the codes for the door, we're not getting through normally. I knew a lot of knights that would probably try to blow up the door. But I think we can do better than that. These doors are hydraulically sealed. If we can find the lines that feed to this door, we might be able to cut the pressure holding it shut. Look for a utility room nearby. This should be it. Take a look. See if you could find the lines to the Overseer's office.
I'll drop the pressure, all right? Okay, the door should be open. Let's go. It appears neither the vault defenses nor the Blood Eagles were a match for you. Quite formidable. You can lower your weapons. It would clearly be futile for me to struggle, and I surrender willingly. Too far? Does that term even apply when the goal is the permanent protection of humanity from the horrors of the Wasteland? I told you my work focused on the health of Appalachia's people. You must see that my research was towards that aim. Do you believe I did this all blindly? Groping madly in the bodies of the innocent for some unknown and hallucinatory secret? With each iteration, each test conducted, I identified flaws in the virus and calculated their removal. I After have no seeing what you've done work. here, I hope hell does exist. Despise me if you will. I took no pleasure in what had to be done. I am sure your Brotherhood will happily interrogate me until I have no tale left to tell. I will be entirely forthcoming, though I expect you will want to conduct your Inquisition within confines more amenable to the Brotherhood. As for the content, I don't of this like voice, the sound of that. The Brotherhood is free to collect anything they like. My work here is finished. FEV was never intended to be a source of abominations and grotesqueries. It was to be the next step in human evolution. Our refinement into something greater and better. Certainly the fools at West Tech were more obsessed with observing its failures than correcting them. But its true purpose was for good. And now it will fulfill that purpose. Listening to this is because making me understand Shin's point of view. This is true. I wish it could have been avoided. It was easier and safer, for myself, if not for others, to release those failures before their metamorphosis was complete. I had work to finish, and I knew the Brotherhood was out Your errors me. tunneled into Fort Atlas and could have killed everyone! Is that so? It seems my failures were indeed steps on the road to success. That level of coordination suggests an increase in cognitive development over the typical example. Still, I bear the Brotherhood no ill will. My apologies for that. I have no doubt that you do, as you wish. Yes, I assumed as much when you entered. Very well. Consider me arrested, if you must. I am ready to face any judgment the Brotherhood wishes to mete out. My work here is complete regardless, and it is too late for you to stop it. I am at your disposal, then. You can head out. I'll radio for a team to secure the site and get the prisoners to safety. Then bring Blackburn back to the fort. I'm sure the others are going to have a lot of questions for him. Good work, Initiate. I'm glad you were here. Think of me what you will. It will change nothing. 